During labour and childbirth, a fascinating phenomenon known as the purple line or labour line can appear, providing valuable insights into a woman's cervical dilation and progress. Now, I prefer to call it the labour line as the line doesn't appear purple on every single person. Now, this line isn't always visible and it might be more pronounced on some individuals more than others, but it does serve as a helpful guide. It's thought to occur as a result of vasoconstriction and pressure from the baby's head as it descends down through labour. Now this line typically starts at the anus and it kind of extends upwards following the cleft between the buttocks. As dilation progresses, this line moves higher up on the back. On lighter skin tones, this line can appear as a pinkish or purplish colour. And on darker skin tones, sometimes it's not as noticeable, but when it is noticeable, it can appear as a darker brown or silver or even sometimes a grey line. This line is a visual indicator that helps midwives and other healthcare providers gauge the extent of cervical dilation without the need for constant vaginal examinations. Estimate, when you are around three centimetres dilated, approximately, you're looking at the line kind of reaching this point. So the anus is there, the line's just about there. At around seven centimetres, which would probably be the time when you're kind of entering transition, it's around here and then fully dilated usually kind of just above the cleft here so it kind of reaches up a little bit further beyond the buttocks so something to look out for when you're in labor